Hey, what's up Blender users? I am Jonathan from Germany, that's who have this weird accent. And in today's tutorial I'm gonna show you how you can create this holographic display or this hologram in Blender. So for this tutorial I'm gonna use the Release Candidate 3 from Blender 2.80. And well, we will start with just a simple model, for example the monkey, and then assign some subdivisions maybe a subdivision rate of 5, apply it, and now you are good to go. So what we will first need for the hologram is a simple texture, and it has to be an image texture. So we will, gonna, uh, we will assign a new material, delete the principal BSTF and add an emission shader, plug the emission output into the surface input, and then a image texture. So I will use a map from J yes, JS Placement, which is a free program which generates you sci-fi height maps, and I've also talked about it uh, in the last tutorial. Mm, you can download this program. You can you can download this program from the download link in the video description. And yeah, we're just gonna import this image, and then put color into color and also get a texture coordinate so you can adjust the scale, texture coordinate and m mapping. So plug generated into vector and vector into vector and if we would now go into the rendered view we can see what it does. We just have our normal map here and we can maybe, well we can just leave it as it is maybe UV is better. The seam um, will not be noticeable after we after we voxelized the whole model. So we're just gonna adjust the emission strength like this, maybe about 10, and also get a color ramp node for the blue color. Like that. So what we will need next is the voxelized script from CG Cookie. Mm, you can just follow their tutorial or go into the video description where the whole script script is displayed and just copy and paste it into here. And you m have to make sure that your model is selected and then what I like to do is just set this number to 6 and run the script. So now we can see we have our model and it's completely made out of cubes which all have a different color. So this is because um, because we have loaded in an image texture uh, all, the, all the faces got scaled down to 0 0.001 so they display only one color one pixel which is then of course only one color and so we get this result. We can adjust it more like this with just the color ramp slider but to get this transparency uh, we have to add another shader which is of course the transparent BSDF and a mixed shader. So for the mixed shader we will need mm, the color from the color ramp as the factor and plug transparent into the other input of the shader. So uh, what, we'll, what we will see next is that it doesn't work because we have to set some uh, some settings because we are in Eevee. Um, so choose as the blend mode, alpha blend and shadow mode, alpha hashed and enable screen space reflection. And now as you can see it just looks totally wrong because this here has to be in the bottom input and the transparent BSDF in the upper input. So now we have this transparent looking hologram. And if we would now go ahead and animate this, we can let it fade in and out. So this was it with this tutorial. Consider subscribing if you want to see more and we will see us in the next video.